Hi, I'm Jim Parker with iDry Systems. Today I'm going to be talking to you about how to connect your new iDry kiln, which should be done by only a licensed local electrician. Uh, but it is pretty straightforward. We're going to take our trusty Phillips head screwdriver here and get access to the rotary disconnect. It is a 208 to 30 volt single phase system. We want this on a 60 amp breaker. Um, but it's pretty pretty simple. Um, once we get this cover off, we see there is a uh, terminal block for the rotary disconnect. Uh, since it's single phase, we only have two wires and then a ground. Um, again, this connection should be made by your licensed electrician. It's pretty straightforward. You can bring your cable in through the bottom of this box with liquid tight conduit or any other kind of conduit that works for you. Um, I'm going to do it today just without that pass through, um, but you would want to pass through into this box with some kind of a liquid tight connection and then just terminate your wires. There are your L1 and L2 power wires. These are the main wires that power up the control panel that, that's just above me. Um, and then of course a ground. So we're going to take our black wire. We're going to put that to L1. And get our connection nice and tight. And our white wire here to L2. And then finally our ground. Again, a simple thing, but should be done by your local licensed electrician. Thanks.